Hey, did you know that silver prices are low right now? Investors are selling their holdings because of a turn down in demand. Once fears subside, we could see a surge in demand for silver as customers come back, which is why it's a perfect time to get your silver IRA started right now. And this month, you'll get an incredible free three ounce silver American virtue coin with a qualified IRA of $20,000 or higher. Call the team now at 877-646-5347 to find out more or visit Noble Gold Investment com. Just remember, there is always a risk of loss and past performance is not indicative of future results. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to another CNN gaslighting session. That's what we do here on this channel. Punish ourselves with lies that are designed to drive us insane. I have one thing before we get there because I do want to pose this to you. It does seem like Republicans fall for this more than Democrats. The Republicans fall for conspiracy theories more than Democrats. Yes? Wrong. Uh, I, I don't know I have sure polls. I have polls to prove it. Here's the COVID conspiracy. Adults who think that the COVID outbreak was planned. Um, Republicans 34%, Democrats 18%. QAnon by party, Republicans 43%, Democrats 19%. People who believe the election lies, Republicans, uh, oh no, people who believe that Biden is the legitimate president, Democrats 98%, Republicans 34%. Oh, she really thinks she's got a slam dunk here. Republicans believe in conspiracy theories about Democrats, but Democrats don't believe in conspiracy theories about Democrats. What exactly does she think this proves? Yeah, I mean, I lived through the Bush administration and a lot of people believe a lot of crazy things about George W. Bush that weren't true either. So I agree with Kevin. Scott Jennings, why are you so weak? Is that why you're one of the only, maybe the only conservative on that network? For example, you could have come back with the fact that Democrats were anti-COVID vaccine when Trump was the president. In 2020, a whopping 88% said that they didn't trust the COVID vaccine. As far as 98% of Democrats believing Joe Biden is a legitimate president and this somehow proving that Democrats don't believe in conspiracy theories, I wonder how Allison would have responded to the fact that in 2000, only 15% of Democrats considered Bush the legitimate president. Democrats were most likely to say that Bush either stole the election or won on a technicality. Also, over half of Democrats believe that Bush either was behind 9-11 or knew about it and let it happen. Sounds a little conspiratorial. I don't need to remind any of you about what happened in 2016 with the corrupt FBI actually disseminating conspiracy theories through the media. Starting with the Steele dossier, which we now know was actual Russian disinformation, which we now know the FBI offered millions for corroboration of. The Democrats were convinced that Trump was a Russian agent for f sake. Here are 18 reasons Trump could be a Russian asset. 18 reasons Trump could be a Russian asset. How many years in journalism have you been? How many years? Many years. Many years. Did you ever think you'd be writing this piece? No. I mean, this is like something out of the Manchurian Candidate totally. or the Americans. I mean, this is the realm of spy fiction. And all of these conspiracy theories being put out by Democrats, the FBI, and the mainstream media led to 68% of Democrats believing that Trump was illegitimate and the election had been stolen. Hillary Clinton was calling Trump illegitimate as late as 2019. Scott Jennings, <laughs> please tell me you're going to come back with at least one of these things. Um, I think that if you have a prior view, like in the case of these schools, if you believe that there are people in the schools who are making the schools into something crazy, so then that's your prior view, and then some of the thing comes, it, it's just easy to just tack that on to what you already believe. So I, I do think that is happening. I actually, preparing for this, researched this today. Oh. There actually is kitty litter in schools. You know why? Because there's cats. No. What the because sometimes schools put it in there in the event of a lockdown or emergency situation and if the students are in the classroom and they cannot get out and go to the bathroom. That's, you know what, that's actually really interesting because you just proved that you can debunk something. You can debunk a hoax. Yeah. You can debunk something. That <laughs> oh, wow. Well, your thoughts on this? I mean, just a lot of distrust of institutions and the government that's really being peddled more often on the right. Don't you think that Republicans yeah, they, are more susceptible? They definitely to are more theories? susceptible. I, I, I would say I'm going. <laughs> I'm going. Oh, 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 I must have had a little fall there. <laughs> Whew, for a minute there, 
I thought that they said that Republicans were more susceptible to distrust in American institutions. <laughs> That's crazy. Don't you think that Republicans yeah, they, are more susceptible? They definitely to are more theories? susceptible. I, I would say <laughs> what? That's a really strange take, considering that it's Democrats who are more likely to distrust police and believe in conspiracy theories that cops are hunting down black people to the point they imagine thousands of black people are killed by police every year. How about the Supreme Court? That's an American institution only 25 percent of democrats have trust in that institution as of the 2016 election 48 percent of democrats said they have little or no trust in the election system something that seems to change whenever they win don't you think that republicans yeah, they, are more susceptible they definitely to are more susceptible. I, I would say how about the electoral college 61 percent of democrats want to abolish it now if network television is any reflection of mainstream democrat beliefs then they generally disagree trust the entire system and want to literally burn it down broken 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 system that's a racist if you grew up in this country it's in you the policing in this country evolved from slave patrol police killing black people defund the police for starters defund 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 the police defund and dismantle the racist institution of american police all right i think this gets my point across in fact it appears the only institution that democrats support is the media don't you think that republicans yeah, they, are more susceptible they definitely to are more theories? susceptible I, mean, I would say stop i mean that's just democrats it's, don't, it's don't, ridiculous not, not, don't not, spread that not, stuff not, not. oh democrats definitely do that well folks well folks that's all i have to say about that if you enjoyed it please hit that like button and make sure to leave a comment to help spread this video thanks a lot <laughs>